All right, everybody, what is up? It's Thunder. Welcome back. I just uploaded this gameplay on Thunderstruck Gaming, where I got a strike team, and I called them in on top of Pride Rock. And a bunch of people in the comment section were like, yo, Thunder, your strike team was camping on top of Pride Rock. They never left. I was like, what? So I had to go back into theater mode, and you guys were right. These dudes camped up on top of Pride Rock the entire time. They never left. They're camping Pride Rock harder than I was. Look at this. I mean, dude, the strike team don't know how to climb down a ladder? <laughs> we know they got some trouble going through doorways, but add climbing ladders to something that the strike team just can't seem to do. I mean, look at this. They're up there camping like it was Black Ops 1, son. Damn. <laughs> Yo, I'll tell you what, man. I Honestly, dude, I cannot wait for Modern Warfare to come out, man. I'm ready to move on, fellas. Ready to move on. We only got, I don't know, the... the the, the release of the game is what three four more months nobody's seen it yet except for you know marcus mariota and some other athletes and the cod vips that signed nda so they can't say nothing and the game critics the game critics have played uh oh damn that melee cheese but the game critics have played modern warfare at e3 behind closed doors super secret and uh actually they were nominated for an award for best online multiplayer fellas and they won they, they won the award for best online multiplayer let me show you guys a tweet from infinity ward right here honestly shocking that a game that is this game even online yet how does a game win best online multiplayer if no one's even played it online so check it out infinity ward tweeted this the results are in we took home best online multiplayer as part of the Game Critics Awards Best of E3 2019. What? Son, stop lying, man. Nobody, listen, I get you showed the critics. I get you showed the critics the game behind closed doors, but who are they playing online against? Who is this secret society of gamers who are playing this online right now? I don't think anyone's played this game online yet. It must have been on LAN. How are you going to win Best Online Multiplayer when you never played online? Oh. You you got me kidding me, son. This shit is hilarious, man. Honestly, dude, let me tell you something, man. This is I already told you how this went down, man. Infinity War pulled up with a couple of screenshots and a bag full of ballistic knife money. And the judges was like, nah, 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 man. Oh, you got a screenshots? We ain't giving you no damn award. Hell no. Infinity War was like, yo, $1,300? The judges was like, shit, come on in. Best online multiplayer? $1,300 bag of money? Come on in. Listen, man. Who did these judges play online against, bro? You've got to be kidding me. Now, don't get me wrong. Don't get me wrong. I'm glad to see this because I want Modern Warfare to be good, damn it. I need Modern Warfare to be good, okay? But the fact that they're winning <laughs> best online multiplayer when everybody knows they've never played online against anybody. I mean, can you imagine how hard it must be to find a Modern Warfare lobby right now? Were they even playing the right Modern Warfare? Maybe they were playing the other Modern Warfare, the original. <laughs> No, that ain't true. We, if they played that game and called it the best online multiplayer, I think it would have cost Affinity Ward more than just $1,300 of Ballistic Knife money to win that award, man. Uh, I mean, the original Modern Warfare was the shit back in the day, but dude, it aged terribly, bro. That game right now is about as slow as a snail on Xanax, bro. I mean, it's that slow. It's that terrible. But it's not like Modern Warfare had the strongest of competition for online multiplayer this year. These games are more known for their campaign. I mean, you had Bleeding Edge, Gears 5... Tom Clancy, Ghost Recon, and Wolfstein, or Steed, I, I can't pronounce it, man, Wolfstein, I never played, Wolfenstein, Wolfenstein Youngblood, did I pronounce it right this time? You guys were tearing me up last video, because I was pronouncing it Wolfstein, Wolfen, Wolfenstein, like Frankenstein, there you go, I got it, I got it, uh, really not the greatest of competition here, I mean, I love Gears 5 campaign, I hated the multiplayer, Bleeding Edge, it kind of looks like a Mortal Kombat, Street Fighter kind of game. Uh, I don't know how many people are actually into that, especially with the way YouTube is now. Uh, let's see, Tom Clancy, Ghost Recon, Breakpoint. I mean, is Ghost Recon popping online? I don't know. And w Wolfenstein Young... I mean, every time I see Wolfenstein, I think more uh, campaign. So these games, I think, are more known for their campaign than their online multiplayer. Well, except for probably Bleeding Edge. So it's not like they had, you know, some stiff competition here. You know, it's not like they were going up against Battlefield or Fortnite or whatever. <laughs> They're not, they, weren't, they didn't really have the greatest of competition at E3. But I hope that even though the judges probably didn't play online against anybody, I hope they're right. I hope this game is good. I need it to be good. Uh, I'm just finding it hard to believe that they were in an online match against some mystery opponent and played and said, oh, yeah, they played for their five or ten minutes. Oh, yeah, this is the best online multiplayer. 
All right, let's go. All right, where's the after party at? Let's get out of here. The only award Infinity Ward should have won is best screenshot, okay? I mean, I've seen footage of all these other games, okay? I've seen Bleeding Edge. I've seen Gears 5. I've seen Wolfstein. Uh, I haven't seen Tom Clancy, but I'm sure it's out there. So they won best online multiplayer, okay? But I'll tell you one thing right now. Ain't no way in hell they're going to take home this award, best action game. Because according to this, that award belongs to Doom Eternal. What? Doom Eternal be Borderlands 3? Damn, son. Doom Eternal must be an amazing game because Borderlands 3 is going to be one of the greatest games you've ever played. I'm telling you guys right now. If you Borderlands 1 was all right. Borderlands 2 is probably one of the best games ever. If you guys never played Borderlands 2, you guys got to get on it right now. Just start playing Borderlands 2 right now until Borderlands 3 drops. Trust me, man, it is not a waste of your time. The game is fantastic. Borderlands 3 is going to be epic. Hey, you know what, fellas? I just might start streaming Borderlands 2 just to get ready for Borderlands 3. I sent a private message out to my channel members this morning, actually. I was like, yo, if any of you guys are interested in doing a playthrough of Borderlands 2 with me, let me know. Drop your PSN down the uh, in the comment section. But if you're not a channel member, you probably didn't get that message. That was just for the channel members only. But even you subscribers, man, you guys want to party up and play some Borderlands 2? I'll start streaming it. That'll be a fun game to stream, man. It's a nice, chill game to stream. And damn that ramp. Woo! Yo, I gotta I gotta start using the rampart again, fellas. I gotta start using the rampart again. It seems like the rampart is stronger than ever. I get insta melted by that damn go. Woo, damn, nice player card, son. Nice player card, man. <laughs> anyway, fellas. If Call of Duty Modern Warfare beats Borderlands 3, I will be shocked. I mean these judges are fugazi, son. There's no way these judges are legit, man. Who are you playing online against? Who are these judges? Who are they? Who are you playing online against? <laughs> Yo, if you got this game online, drop down the comment section, man. What are the kill streaks? T tell us about the game. Who are these guys are that have this game online that are playing it right now? T tell me how it is. Somebody in the comment section that has this game that played against the critics. What's your favorite kill streak? What's the best gun in the game? What's the best class setup? Drop it all down in the comment section, man, so we're all ready. Somebody out there must have the game that's playing these critics online. I don't know. I don't have it. I wish I did. Hey, you know what, man? A small part of me thinks that the critics never even played this game. They probably just went back there and saw everybody was like, all right, man, we got to hand out this uh, E3 award here, this very prestigious award that's going to make or break careers. So which one of you was going to donate the most to win best online multiplayer? You know, Infinity War was like, yo, we got this we got this satchel full of ballistic knife money from these knives only and his homie. <laughs> the judges were like, ballistic knife money? Come on in. Awarding best online multiplayer now. Infinity Ward, Modern Warfare. All right. All right. Nice screenshots, fellas. Now get out of here. Give me that money and get out of here. All right. You guys won. We out. That's probably how that went down, man. This shit, this is a shady business, man. Nothing is legit. The older you get in life, you're going to come to find that there's so much shady crap going on in the world, dude. It's disgusting. Okay. Uh, like, you really expect me to believe you guys were playing an online multiplayer match when no one has seen the game? Best online multiplayer? Who the hell were you playing online against? The bots? Give me a break, dude. I mean, of course you're going to nominate best multiplayer if you're playing the bots. I mean, hell, if I played Advanced Warfare right now against the bots, I'd probably say this is the best online multiplayer too. Everybody has fun when they're playing against bots. The bots don't do nothing. You feel like a god playing against bots, man. The only thing better than playing against bots is getting on a secondary account with no stats and playing a reverse boosted lobby against clueless noobs that try and shoot down VSATs with tomahawks, man. That's the only thing better than playing against bots. I mean, I want to believe these judges. I want to believe that Modern Warfare is the best online multiplayer. Because believe me, I, after playing Black Ops 4, yo, I need something good, man. We all need a good COD game to play. But as long as there's microtransaction money out there, as long as there's people like these knives only and his homie paying $1,300 for a ballistic knife, Activision always going to have money to bribe these dudes, man. How do you know that these awards are legit? And damn, my aim went to trash since using the strobe, bro. Damn, all that hip firing, bro. I got lazy, man. I got to learn how to aim again in this game. Yo, where's my Zim at, man? Where's my Kronos Max at, man? I got to go to Walmart after this commentary, son. <laughs> nah, you know I don't use that stuff, fellas. Uh, anyway, man, listen. Uh, I have not played this map yet, by the way, either, guys. The uh, Hacienda Twilight or hacienda after dark or whatever the hell variant they called it the hacienda where all the lights are off i've seen footage of it online though it looks super dark man have you guys played this map yet with the lights off is it as dark as it looks online or the people just have some messed up color correction settings i don't know what's going on but i'm looking at it online i've watched a few gameplays i'm like yo there's no way this map could be that damn dark like <laughs> what's got worse visibility hacienda twilight 
or Arsenal Sandstorm, man. Drop down in the comment section, man. Treyarch just doesn't want us to see anything, dude. This game's so bad, Treyarch don't even want us seeing it. They're like, yo, we messed this game up so bad, man. This is embarrassing. Just blind them with the Sandstorm. Get all sand in their face. Turn off all the lights. Tell everyone to forget what they know. Nah, this ain't us, bro. Forget what you know. Turn off the lights. Blind them with the Sandstorm. Ah! Anyway, fellas, that's all I got. Thank you all so much for watching this gameplay commentary. If you enjoyed it, please don't forget to like and share it. All that good shit. And I'll see you on the next one. Peace!